Yes, it is the house ruling cat. What's up everybody, hope you're doing great, I'm Diego, and this time, we're gonna do a reaction, first time watching commentary of The Owl House, Season 1, Episode 6, Hootie's Moving Hassle. That has to be, I'm just gonna say it right away, that has to be some kind of reference or wordplay with House Moving Castle. Last time with Covention, we really saw a fascinating episode filled with very compelling world building, including the Coven of the Emperor, and possibly the two most engaging character dynamics introduced so far, Eden Lilith and Lewis and Amity. Loving these themes about individuality versus the system, honesty, work ethic. Every episode that passes is just more evident than ever that nothing is what it seems like. By the time of this recording, there was some craziness to be seen in this episode. So grab a cup of tea and let's watch it. Yeah, this is not the same setting uh, as usual. I'm at, at, I'm at my girlfriend's right now, in case you're wondering. <laughs> <laughs> Hexes Hold'em is the most tricky game on the boiling aisles. She really is embracing that owl persona. And there's ice everywhere. It feels like I'm watching Lee in the Illuminati or something. <laughs> what? I'm vengeance. <laughs> I want to play this game. The wild card. There's always one wild card. Damn. Winner, Ida. <laughs> I want to see Ida versus Hootie. That would be so hilarious. It feels fluffy. Yeah, it's happening again. No, okay. Yeah, you go and transform into owl. Oh god, it's gonna come back. If there's one person who knows how to raise that curse, maybe it's Lilith. Maybe it's her sister. Maybe. Hootie's Moving Castle. I can't think what the name is. Just like House Moving Castle. I'm out of elixir. Last time this happened, you turned into this thing. Uh, oh, that you even. <laughs> that look is. I knew that you somehow captured those moments, Luz. Mark it. Take these and fly ahead. She'll have to follow us. Ah, Luz, no. Sore loser. Give me back. <laughs> I don't think I've said this enough. I love the visual design of this world. So creepy. And it's a huge skeleton right there. <laughs> now <Nah>, tiny nose. <laughs> An egg is the boss? What? Ooh. Demon hunters. Dangerous nomads who capture and sell the most powerful beasts. Wow. Oh no! Don't hurt the demons, Steve. Willow and Gus. Oh, we're gonna spend more time with them. That's great. Who hurt my babies? <laughs> no way. Amity seems so disconnected right there, just in that visual alone. Bring something to life with moon magic. It's not her fault she was born without talent. Amity, uh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Do not wake up the beast in Willow. I mean, come on, you're better than that. I know. I have a feeling. A real human bucket. Appreciate your enthusiasm. I'll go tell Ida. I'm all out till next time. Uh, Noses, feathers are a good look for you. Martin. <laughs> the feathers. If she's not cured temporarily, she's gonna wreak havoc here. You could try your luck later this evening. Ooh. There's a guy with a stand, Grim Hammer. If anyone has what you need, it's him. <laughs> That's like the deals you don't want to tell anybody about. Do a moonlight conjuring and stick it to Amity, so can we- Not tonight, I'm going out. Sitting in a circle holding hands, it's like magic for babies. <laughs> <laughs> I love how the show is still like, kind of like a satire about every cliche. Did Ida say it was okay? <laughs> no. Um, yes, she said yes. You can do it at the Owl House. At the Owl House. Ha the Owl House is gonna be the house moving castle. <laughs> oh my god. Luz, you're in charge while I'm out. She's so in Hoodie charge. No, this is gonna be a mess for Hootie. I'm a big boy. <laughs> Suspicious. You're doing that thing where you're hiding your hoodie. Meow, I'm not. Uh, oh, where's King? He's right here. I. <laughs> I can't 
Everybody's a baby. Ida is the mother of all. You mess up the house, <laughs> I will never trust you again. Ooh. No pressure. <sighs> mm. This might create some conflict between Ida and Luz. That might just be really interesting because they get along really well. Company, <laughs> No! 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 Hoodie! Hoodie needs company, needs friends. I love him. Hate him, but I love him. Actual humans! Oh god. We've got weird music. Eyes, more eyes. We've got a bucket! How many more eyes are in this? What's the symbolism? We find an object to animate. It's our first time. We should pick something meaningful. Something beautiful. You're gonna break the something meaningful and beautiful. <laughs> that has to be a reference to the early guy that Luz was into in the show. Look at the moon, oh my god. Magic for babies. Magic for babies is going to break your house, Ida. Ironically. Ooh. I really want to see Hootie involved in this. No. Oh! oh! Yes, it is house moving cat. <laughs> it's an owl. It's a walking owl as the house. <laughs> what? No. I have risen hood. Oh my god, it's going into bones borrow. Oh god. Just in time. Hold hands again. <laughs> the power of friendship is gonna save them. We're controlling it with the power of friendship. <laughs> the moon. <laughs> and more important things. Friendship and bravery. Gotta be back before the moon sets or Ida will kill me. <laughs> No, the hunter is going to think he's going to think they're demons. Ooh. Oh, nice. This place at night. Curse. I need that elixir. Quick. Here's where I'm sensing the real essence of the show. The darkness. I want it. Oh, that's creepy. Sorted affair. <laughs> wow, that's the stuff of nightmares. Yes. I'm going to a moonlight conjuring. No, mom, you can't. A <laughs> bird? <laughs> yes, it's sad that you're asking. <laughs> oh, it's an actual bird. <laughs> this is the best world. No, don't scare her off. No. I've never pranked anyone before. I mean, that's kind of bullying right there. <laughs> the power of friendship. Or who's got no talent. Actually, I'm starting to think we should head back. Amity's updating her Pinstagram. <laughs> Pinstagram? <laughs> Humans can bite it? Let's do it! <laughs> no! <laughs> they have even Instagram in this world? Oh god, the demon hunter. I cannot believe I'm watching this show. I love how modern and, and just satirical and everything it is. Welcome, welcome, welcome! Jelly beans! They're literally delicious! <laughs> you are Grimhammer? There's an eye in every frame, I swear. It's so unsettling. Lucky for you, I just stepped up. Hazam! I'll give you ten snails. I don't think that's gonna be a scam. A thousand snails? Game are you playing? <laughs> Capitalism! Capitalism! I hate this world. I win, you give me the elixir. You win, you can take something of mine. Oh, what fun! You're on! Mm. What are you gonna offer, though? I can't, I can't tell. <laughs> It's like that giant uh, cookie monster in... Well, cookie monster. Uh, Instructo <laughs> reminds me of that. Giant crossbow? I, uh, no, you're gonna get... Yeah, you're gonna be caught sooner or later. <laughs> a joke? <laughs> I thought for a second he was gonna tell a joke afterwards. <laughs> no, Hoodie! You want this to end as you say? The power of friendship, really? No me hablas así. 
I love the spit of Spanish. I swear. A mí nadie me habla así, <laughs> diría Luz. What? Hootie would taste terrible. I'm a refined taste. The writing on Hootie is spot on. The, the humor is amazing from him. Really what you want to be doing with your life? Tossing kids from cliffs? <laughs> Actually, yes. Yes. It's been my dream since I was a boy. <gasps> I can leave them. I was a strange <laughs> child. <laughs> <laughs> no! You can't trust anybody over here, and everyone is basically a monster. I'm so sorry. You wanted to turn back, but I just had to show off to Amity. The truth is, she and I used to be friends. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> that is brand new information. What? I just wanted to prove to her that I was a powerful witch too. That's ridiculous. You helped bring a house to life. Amity doesn't know what she's talking about. Willow is pretty powerful. It's fascinating to see how Ego is getting both Amity and Willow. Maybe not. they're not so different. Painful to watch. <laughs> You card shark. You hustle. Yeah. Wild card. Then yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Terrors, the creator, had so, so, so much fun with this show already. I've always wanted a tiny servant. Oh, God. I can't perform magic. No. Oh. Are we going to see her as owl monster again? Owl lady. No, she's gonna get caught. I for I I always forget there's wanted posters. No! Processing. Oh, it's gonna be connected with Lilith! Maybe Lilith sent this guy or something. I don't know. Whoa, let's go, Willow. I wanna see a confrontation between Willow and Amity. After that, Lilith ate a confrontation last episode. I really wanna see that. The power of friendship. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Why were you even wearing that? <laughs> it's just to be threatening. <laughs> Look at the mess. Just children, Tom. <laughs> Tom. I love that he has such a normal name. Tom. <laughs> I know I have a problem. I get obsessed with Hexes Hold'em. <laughs> <laughs> Already on its way to send this witch here to the conformatorium, and I just back with the warden guys. <laughs> no way, who these moving hassle is over here. You. Nothing can stop me. <laughs> oh, Sorry, uh, I, uh, such a mess. <laughs> Did you even realize who, who Wait, was there? Was the yeah. yeah. <laughs> Please work. It has to be. Yeah, the real one. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Oh my scam stand. Yeah. <laughs> my scam stand. I wonder how many scam stands are over the world. Did Just like it? nothing happened. Is the room spinning? <laughs> 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 Oh, Woody, I love Woody so much. He's growing on me a lot. Oh, man. You held a moonlight conjuring. Uh, and you animated my house. My house! Yes! But you saved me? You saved me? You're gonna say? If you're gonna eat me, just do it now! <laughs> you didn't have to do that. Yes, Luz. Yet they did. They're really, they're really great friends. That was totally amazing. I knew that. So joining you for next year's conjuring. No way. I can't believe they animated a whole house. <laughs> exactly. That's pretty powerful. Too bad no one will know of our daring adventures. <laughs> what if we couldn't move a doll? Where's Hamity? Where's Hamity here? She's on her, by her by her own. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> She's gonna see this. <laughs> she can <can't. laughs> I need more Amity Loose Willow and Gus drama. That's gonna be so good. It has to be next episode at least. I wanna see all of that unravel. Very interesting to see Amity by herself. Even though she has a group of friends and all, I suspect that Amity is actually very alone. 
just based on the framing alone at the at the end friends were hanging together and amity was just so she was on her own you know and she seems she seems comfortable on her own if anything with now willow being like revealing that she and amity were yeah, friends what? once maybe they're building up to uh amity moving from one group of friends to another maybe just maybe if she got to understand Luz last episode she got to tell her like i don't think nothing's gonna stop you from performing magic maybe a similar kind of understanding might be uh achieved between willow and amity maybe just maybe i don't know the way Everything was told in frame over here. That was really interesting. Who is moving hassle? I really, really liked it. The best one so far is still the last one. It's still the last one, but this one is very solid for me. I really love the whole, the whole dynamic between uh, Luz, Willow, and Gus is really heartwarming. I just got to see, I think in this episode, more like the true essence maybe of this show, which is like the dark stuff. It's the darkness, is the creepy, really creepy stuff when Ida was going at night in Bonesboro. I really want to see more of that in the in this world because I, I really felt that shining throughout the Intruder episode, that drama between Lilith and Ida. And over here, the humor is on point. The writing on Hootie is so good and the voice acting the delivery is amazing interesting how like to see like how much amity is getting to her similar to how how much uh loose willow and gus are getting to amity's head you know like being the top or being the best you know for being better like a double-edged sword for both parties if they're gonna confront each other again what's going to be the dynamic between Luz and amity this scam guy about to get it into real trouble you know because he was aware of the posters and all and he was aware about the emperor's cup and price and we got to see last episode about lilith mission about having to capture Ida for the Emperor's Cabin because she's gonna get a prize out of that. I wonder if Lilith somehow, somehow having like a scheme over here, like plotting over here and creating this big plan, maybe. I love the world building in this episode with the Demon Hunter. I wanna see more of this show at night because it, that can be really creepy and terrifying. This really was like an adventure episode. This episode was a lot of fun. Maybe not as narratively rich or strong as the past two ones, but it's still very solid. Still very solid. I really liked it. I think it's a very fun episode. Last but not least, Luz interacting in Spanish. Every time she says something in Spanish, like it's it feels so genuine. It feels like it doesn't feel scripted. It feels so genuine. I love it. I'm loving, I think, every single element about this show. You guys have told me that the first 15 episodes are not even the strongest part of this show. So super looking forward to what's next. Thank you so much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know in the comments what you think about this episode, the characters, the themes, and, and everything. And we'll see each other in the next one. See ya.